For Canton Public Schools, the word new is in the air. McNeil will actually be built right back here at the McNeil site. We will demolish everything and build right back here. Canton Elementary as well. And the ninth grade academy will be built on, on site at the high school. The rebuilding is anticipated to start towards the end of the summer. With McNeil Elementary dating back to 1952, resolutions to security, safety, and population issues are long overdue. With the new building and the layout of the school, we will be able to accommodate parents more as well as our staff as it relates to parking. Right now our parking lot is pretty tight. Um, we actually have to park sometimes on, on the street to accommodate our parents and staff. With this future construction approaching, where will the kids be during renovations? Our students will be displaced at a location that's designated by the Canton Public School District, Canton Elementary. Since they're building behind Canton Elementary, they will actually still be placed in their building. They will not be displaced at all. Growth and in infrastructure by the referendum is also joined technologically with the one-to-one -one initiative that gives 9th through 12th graders at the high school laptops. The students deserve to have a facility that's updated to the 21st century that's going to help them um, advance. They, the community deserves to have a facility that they can be proud of. Um, as well as our teachers, is helping to build morale within our teachers. Our student morale and self-esteem about their new school is through the roof. Whitehead, being a product of Canton Public Schools, is excited for what lies ahead. Mara Mode, JSU-TV.